it's usually pretty simple to just drag and drop a clip into the timeline. Grab the clip in the event browser by clicking and holding inside the yellow range selector. Drag the clip to the timeline and let go. The clip is dropped into an area of the timeline known as the primary storyline. Go ahead and get some more practice by adding a few more clips to the primary storyline. There are some advanced techniques involving layered video that we'll talk about later. For now, just make sure that when you add a new clip using drag and drop, that you place it at the end of the primary storyline. In fact, you can also experiment with placing clips between two existing clips. There's a keyboard shortcut that makes the process of building a rough cut even easier. After you set an in and out point, press E on the keyboard to append that clip to the project you're building. In other words, pressing E will place that clip at the end of the timeline you've built so far. As you continue to add clips, it'll seem like you're running out of room in the timeline. Use the scroll bar at the bottom of the timeline to move forward and backward. You can also zoom in and out in the timeline so that it shows more or less of the project in the window. Use the zoom slider in the lower right of the timeline to zoom in and out. If you prefer keyboard shortcuts, try using Command Plus and Command Minus.